Girls don't Let want me ask me. you guys this yeah, question sucks. about height, because I mean, height is one of the things that always comes up. It's one of the things a lot of guys like to just focus on. Oh, I'm not six foot tall. I'm fucked, right? Because you know, we've all seen women's dating uh, apps say, you know, I like tall guys or must be over six or six foot one or six foot two. Sometimes they even give you like an exact number, like you have to be at least six foot two or something like that. Um, how do you guys deal with that? Because I know um, Renegade's the only super tall guy here. I mean, I'm, I got a funny a, story about that. It's yeah, a shit Paul, I'm the shortest. You, six foot. you, you ever done that? <laughs> I'm five What's nine. Your height, Jason, I'm a uh, I'm five eleven, and so with boots yeah. on because we wear boots everywhere. Yeah, yeah, so right? six easily. So I'm six. I so I put I just put two. yeah I just put six feet in all the dating app. No yeah. one's ever said anything because I'm got it. The, typically the gals I'm dating are also maybe. Five, two, five, three. They can't tell. Me. Yeah, women are short. They yeah. don't know the difference. It's, 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 no, it's, Paul, uh, Paul, you're like what? Five foot ten? Five foot one? No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, five about four. five foot nine and some change. Yeah. This is how you know I'm about average height because I, I, I have to caveat that half inch. And Moth? <laughs> yeah, about five eleven, six foot. Right around where uh, JB is. Irishman? Yep. Now, Irishman, five nine. Five nine. Yeah, so, yeah. I mean. Five nine. So yeah, I, I, was, I, was, I, was I say I'm five. I've does, said I'm five. Does height matter? Yeah, or, like women have said guys, to me, "Oh my God, you're so tall!" Like they like guys, a, a tall, big guy, but it doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. I mean, all all of you guys. I mean, in fact, most of you are under six so, foot. Put it in I, centimeters. I got a fl- <laughs> like I, I tried to, no joke because because I'm in Mexico now, so I realized yeah. 180 centimeters is like the six foot here. I'm like, mm-hmm. oh good, I, I literally am 180 centimeters. No boots on, boots on. Oh, I'm way up there. Um, <laughs> but when I've gone back to the states too, they see centimeters. They're like, oh, like what? Who are you? Like, are, oh, you're from this town? What? But why centimeters? Like, oh yeah, I live abroad, and th- you're well, piquing their interest again. So yeah. tr- try try things out too. That's it. Yeah, one of the shit tests and two get creative. Like just just, ahead, Paul. just steamroll yeah. that obstacle. Yeah, no, it doesn't like, I mean, I, I, women tend to think I'm taller just because of the way I act. I, I think you're wider weird. than you're taller. Right. <laughs> yes. Yeah. yeah and yeah, that yeah. too, you know? But, and yeah, so you're, you're, what do they call it? A, a shit brick house? Is that the, the yeah. <laughs> brick, brick shit house. Definitely shit a shit brick house. Yeah, my bad. Yeah. De- <laughs> that, definitely. But uh, yeah, so I, I mean, I found that it didn't matter really. Like I've had women that, you know, I've dated that were taller than me and they just, as long as you are dominant and you dominate them and then you make them feel small, then that's fine. It's all about, do they feel small or not? But I know we're talking yeah. about apps we got to cut through some of that stuff. If you're on, if you're not between six and like, if not over six feet tall, give yourself a couple inches. They lie on those things. Just lie. Who cares? Because what's going to happen is you'll meet with them and they'll be like, you know, if they, if they're curious about it, they'll might be like, are you, so you're five eleven? be like, Psh, ah, I, I don't even remember she, what I put. I don't tell the she's truth. She's ten pounds things. heavier than her best photo. Like <laughs> that's, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> well, I mean, of course. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Here's the thing. So, I mean, I, if you're five foot one, truth, don't say so. you're six foot. But if you're like five yeah. foot ten, yeah. you can get away with six foot with boots, right? She just wants to be taller yeah. than her. That's it. Girls just want to date taller. Yeah, exactly. She just wants to be with a guy that's bigger than her. Six foot looks like. Now, guys that are that's about self awareness. Yeah, right. Put the boots on. You know, change your style. That's what I was about to say. I'm about as wide as I am tall too. So I'm like, okay, well, maybe I don't need to build my back out that wide because then I'll look more of a square. I can kind of lean the waist and you, you, but you learn those things about yourself. The dating market gives you feedback. Yeah, yeah. If you let it, if you pay attention, if you actually listen to women, they are honest. They will. You, you you think they're bullshitting you, but like, oh no, she she literally means that. That that is what it is. Um, and you can take those. Women are very account. honest with their behavior. I mean, I'll tell you guys about yeah. height. Like, I mean, like, oh, you know, you're too my... big, you're too skinny, you're too fat, you're too this. Like, well, all right. Yeah, so, so what are the? Are they sleeping with you? So what are the woes of being six foot six, <laughs> Renegade? Uh, well, so at the six foot six area, I'm actually like almost like I think the perfect height is like six three. That's like I mean, like you're one of the few guys Between that I six stand foot around, and like six four. Like, from like I've stood beside him, six, one, and, and he's a tall dude, and I'm like at least six foot two, right? Right. Ideal yeah. height from when they run like numbers on it, women tend to like between six foot and six foot four is about the cap. And then it starts to have diminished returns. Yeah, exactly. You know? exactly. And, and so I'm two inches into that diminishing return that. side of the equation. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. I mean, I'll say, though, like I've definitely noticed like girls tend to be like height supremacists, as we call them, <laughs> um, because they <laughs> nice. definitely have a very built in. And it's kind of natural, right? You want that built in level <laughs> yeah. of um, security with your with your partner. But you know, what I've found is, especially with the, the guys that I hang with, a lot of the guys that I know that do <clears throat> extremely well the most are the shorter guys that well, they might be like five, six, but their personality is seven foot tall. Talk my about the friend, five, 
Right. Talk about That's the amazing. five foot six personality guy because guys always question me on that. I've yeah. told the story about an old roommate that I've had that was like five foot four. Pocket Hercules. And he was a slayer, pocket Hercules. Yep. Yeah, you heard the story, yep. right? Yep. Five foot six. I'll so go ahead and tell your story way. and I'll just shut up. So so I have what we real hey, quick. Paul, I want to hear Renegade's story on the five oh, foot sorry, six. You dude. Story. Hold on. Bad. <laughs> uh, I, I got a lot of stories with this guy. Uh but he's yeah, so he's one of those I'll never forget because this guy, so there was this team of like volleyball players that came into this place that we're at like from so all these girls are like minimum like 511 right just tall amazonian just very good looking athletic girls and so um my friend he's he's five foot six and he says it's like oh look at the my friend was like my other friend was like hey man like look at all those tall girls like trying to go to monolo but he's like dude let me get my personality axe. I'm about to go chop down some trees. So literally <laughs> walks in. That's awesome. Starts talking to, to all of them, introduces us to, to everyone. <clears throat> so one of the girls is like about six one. He winds up hooking up with her in the bathroom at this place. And we're just like, it's always one of those examples that stood out to me. Cause he used to say, I'm even though I'm five, six, my personality is seven feet tall. And so mm. it really is true about how he really owns his skin and he's very comfortable. And he's like, yeah, okay, you know what? I'm, I'm short and there's literally nothing I can do about that. But at the end of the day, that it could either be something that I get hung up on personally or I just go out and just own it. Um, and really what it comes down to is, again, right, that being able to just go out there and see what happens with it. Because if it's not a big deal to you, then it's not going to be a big deal to other people. If you make it a big deal in your own head, yep. that's going to subconsciously start to translate and permeate out, and it's going to make it a big, big deal for other people. And so self so self self in other areas too. Like if you're yeah. five six and a DJ, you don't have to worry. I had a buddy. I'm like, dude, how do you stay right. with chicks? He was a gym buddy, so like more of a spotter type thing. We never hung out. I'm like, dude, like how do you do this? Random club to a club one night. Like pulled a girl right out from underneath me. I'm like, dude, you're disgusting. What the hell? Guy sold coke. <laughs> I'm like, okay, I can't compete with that. It's, it's not so, a joke. That, that's in the market. So yeah. here's how they think, though. So it's, yes, yes, women want the best that they can do, but it's subjective. It's subjective through what they feel like they feel like that is. It's not the subjective measure. This is where a lot of guys get on the Internet and they fuel guys' insecurities. Oh, well, objectively, six foot tall is better, more <laughs> tall, you know, so you can't get girls you want if you're under that. It's not how women think or how their attraction triggers work. When yep. guys approach things like that, I automatically know they suck with women because they have they're no acting, idea, no idea like how. Well, it sure, but then they have no idea how women operate. They, they haven't really been around women or dated enough women to see what happens. And I got a good story, a quick anecdote to illustrate this. So a friend of mine is uh, actually he's in the acting thing and he's going to be in a pretty huge movie with coming out in the next year or two, like uh, one of the superhero movies and he's the lead. And I can't say oh, anything cool. more than that because he's, it's, it's all like non-disclosure agreements and stuff. Right. So this dude is like jacked, good looking dude, but guess what? He's not super tall. He's like five, seven, you know? And so in Hollywood, he'll wear shoe lifts. So mm -hmm. he's like five eleven. All right. But he's really only about five, seven. So he went out on it with a date on a girl with a girl. He had a nice time. Whatever seemed good. She never called him back. Ghosted him. She went to a party, found out he was going to be the lead in this movie and an actor. Of course. And, and then she texted him back. Right. It was it was hey, whatever. Ex, exes the, do that to you. They, they see your Instagram. Sure. And they're like, oh, well, you have a jet ski. Like, hey, so, how's it so yeah. Yeah. And so he he you know, kind of talked with her a little bit and kind of got down to the root of, well, what was the reason for you not calling me back? Like really? And got her comfortable enough to be able to t tell him. And she said, well, you were a little bit shorter than me. I was, didn't really like that, but you know, I, I thought I'd give it a chance. I heard this, his status outweighed his height at that point. Now he never went out with her again because he wants ge genuine desire for uh, as far as being an alpha genetic sexual option, not for status, money, or the other things. And he's right doing that, yeah. yep. right? There's you get a lot of that from seeking too, so that's why a lot of guys, there's a debate 100%. whether to use that channel or not. I consider marketing channels. Yeah, All right, um, well, in a, a, okay. finish up, Paul. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the point is, though, it's under a series of categories. If you're five six, but your confidence is up, your personality hits triggers for her. Your game is good. Other things are good about you. She'll see you as a genetic option to want to be with. <clears throat> it doesn't have to be status necessarily. She will change her mind. Her attraction in the moment has a lot to do with her subjective feelings that can change at other moments. And so you can't get hung up on one insecurity or a trait. You just have to <clears throat> elevate yourself in every other category and you'll do just fine.